welcome and welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here i'm farin i do all types of natural hair and skincare videos along with some vlogs if that is the type of content that you like don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell and you won't miss anything else from me for today's video i decided that i wanted to share my favorite wash and go combo right now like i use these products i use two of these products together all the time and that is how i got this amazing wash and go that i have right here so if you are interested to find out then go ahead grab you a snack sit tight and let's go ahead and get into this so first and foremost if you are familiar with my channel my wash and goes turn out better when i do them in the shower so that's where we are my wash day is from the sol de janeiro video that i just posted i will have it linked in the cards as well as the description box down below so check that out and we are just going to start here with Pattern Beauty's leave-in conditioner. Honestly, between this and the Ajwa Beauty, those are the two leave-in conditioners that I've been reaching for recently when I have been doing my wash and goes. And of course, I apply my leave-in, even my leave-in, to soaking wet hair. I apply it liberally. I am squeezing the product into my hair. I want to make sure Fred is smothered and covered and ready for this wash and go. Okay. Yes. So once I have fully applied the leave-in conditioner, y'all, I go in with the main choices, ancient Egyptian 24 karat glistening gold twisting gel, which I know it's not new, but it's new to me because I'm not really big on main choice products. It's just not something that I ever kept in my stash. And I only picked this up because J-Mac raved about it so much and she loved it. And I was like, <laughs> I'll try it. It was on sale at Sally's and I picked it up. So just a little backstory. I hate this gel. I tried it for a braid out and it was sticky and it was nasty and it dried my hair out and I absolutely hated it, wanted to throw it away. But then I don't know what came over me and I was like, well, I might as well use it. Let's try it for a wash and go. So you all know I am pretty heavy handed. I slap it on my hair liberally. I use the praying hand method. <laughs> I use the praying hand method along with some raking. I just like to make sure that my hair is covered from the root to the tutu with the product because listen, Fred is dense. I don't have time to be sitting here shingling each and every coil. So by making sure that my hair is soaking wet and applying these products liberally, that is really how I get the result that I get. And y'all, I really have been enjoying this for my wash and goes. It completely blew my mind, but that's not it. No, no, no. I have a secret ingredient into really making my wash and go pop. And that is the Alake Naturals Lemongrass Styling Mousse. Another definitely not new, but just new to me. Like I'm just on this whole new hair journey, I feel like. But y'all, this mousse is like moisturizing. It like balances out this twisting gel so well. I apply it very heavy handed. I, you can never use too much mousse in my opinion. And so I really, really, really go in with the mousse and I make sure that like, maybe if I missed it with the gel, I've got it covered with the mousse. So because this gel is so sticky and custardy, my coils tend to stick together. And when I add this mousse on top, it just goes in and creates this separation that really just make my coils like, like they just spring up and out. And there's no frizz, there's no flakes. You see all of this product on my hair. It's practically white, but y'all, no. I let my hair air dry for an hour, hour and a half, and then I go in with my diffuser. It was late at night when I did it, so I just threw my bonnet on. I didn't stretch my hair at all last night. Now, I did go in and stretch the roots today before this video, but 
yeah like these are my results and like there's like no frizz it bounces back there's no product on my hands it's not tacky it's not sticky it's not hard but it's got really good hold like i know this wash and gut was going to last me at least three days and it has just really been my favorite combination today you've actually seen this wash and go combination in that briogeo scalp revival video mm -hmm. that was it of course during the sol de janeiro video mm -hmm. that was it and the valentine's day vlog that i did same wash and go combo it is really working for me like i'm just i'm scared to mess with a good thing so in the comments down below let me know have you ever tried these two together what were your results or if not tell me what your favorite wash and go combo is and like maybe i will try it out too because spring has sprung and your girl is in a wash and go mood i absolutely love it that is all that i have for you guys today i really hope you enjoyed this video please Take a second to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Thank you guys so much. Sometimes I'll upload a video and like I have a like as soon as it's posted and y'all that just like really makes my heart smile. So thank you guys again. I appreciate you all so much and I will see you in the next one.